Hi, my name is Sam, and in this Avisa tutorial, we will cover auto skeletonization. So, to start out, I already have segmented this. So, it just has the pores. So, it goes from that to this. So, I did that by using a median filter, then using interactive thresholding. So, I'll link a video in the description with how to do that. So, now that we have this, we can skeletonize the pores using the auto skeletonization module. So you just click auto, and it's super simple and easy. See? And then let's attach a uh, spatial graph view. So what I've done is I've connected a volume rendering to the foam dot threshold and set the alpha value to 0.02. So this allows us to see the spatial graph view and inside each of the each of the pores. So as you can see, each line represents a connection between the pores. Okay? So you can use this to analyze how the pores connect and just get a general vi visualization of that. So now on to autoskeletonization. So notice the smoothing method. So if you click OK. It will, you can smooth it however much you want. You can smooth it like 10, which is not much, or which is a fine amount. You can also change how many times it will smooth the data. You can, so you can add a distance map. You can also thin the data. We'll also just have the lines. Or you can also do a trace line. Thanks so much for watching. Please just hit that subscribe button if you want more videos and just post any suggestions in the comments.